This is Mary and Richard with Let Us Worship. In Greensboro, North Carolina, I saw a heroin addict throw his needles on the altar and start testifying of God's deliverance. God set him completely free. At that same event, I was able to pray with a young woman struggling with severe anxiety and panic attacks, something that God actually healed me from in 2016. I knew in that moment that God was healing her. We cried, we prayed, we hugged, and there are so many other wild testimonies just like that. People getting up out of their wheelchairs, getting set free from addictions and mental health issues, and also people getting set free from gender confusion, which so many pastors today are even afraid to mention from the pulpit. In all these stories and many more just like it, and all the stories to come of testimonies of breakthrough and revival. I mean, revival, what better cause is there to donate to, to pour into, to sow seeds? So thank you so much if you've already given through donations and or volunteering with your time and energy. But this is the time 